Hi guys, so now it's time to start cutting up your still life and attaching it to the other piece of paper. So you need scissors, you need some sort of adhesive, and you need your drawing that you drew for assignment number two, and you need a new sheet of paper. It's up to you however you want to cut it. It doesn't matter as long as you cut it in different geometrical shapes. So I'm choosing some um, triangles, some irregular shapes, some uh, normal shapes, parallelograms, rhombuses, And now I've cut up my artwork. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take these pieces. I'm just going to play around with them like they're a puzzle. I may want some of them to be in the right order. I may want some of them to be in other placements. I'm not going to overlap them because if I overlap them, then that means that I have more space that I have to color and draw on in the future from the next part of this series. I might want to stick one up in there. If I like my placement of everything, then I'm going to take my adhesive and glue it down. Okay, so my adhesive, because I didn't have glue stick here at my house, I've got this little glue tape. I'm just going to put some glue tape on the back and then glue it down. If you have a glue stick or liquid glue, you can use that. Liquid glue, you don't need to use a lot. A little bit will go a very long way. And again, glue it down. All right, once you're done gluing down all of your pieces, come back to watch the next video.